Hail and well met everyone, Captain Deadeye is back with you with more World of Warcraft Wrath of the Lich King Classic and our Human Warlock. I hope everyone is doing well today, thank you so much for clicking on the video and spending just a few moments of your day with me. Uh, we are in flight between Ironforge and Felsimar. Uh, we're going to run over to um, the gate, oh, to Syrian Gorge, and we need to talk to Mountaineer Petalbetty. Uh, I had to look him up where he was uh, at the end of the last episode. Uh, I looked on the map, couldn't find him, um, so I had to look him up, and he's actually at the gate between uh, Loch Modan and Syrian Gorge. So we're going to go talk to him, and I think after that he sends us to Ironforge. So we'll uh, we'll just hearth back there if that's the case. And then from there, we're going to make our way back into Syrian Gorge and continue questing today. So thank you, thank you, thank you for joining me. I really do appreciate it. Got a couple of potions there. I had to buy some uh, water and uh, food when we go back to town. I can just do that now. It's right here. That way I don't forget it before we head back to Syrian Gorge where there is none. Fill your tankard and pull up a chair. We've stories to tell and kegs to empty. There we go. I'll do five more. That way we've got that. And then, what do you have for food? Homemade cherry pie? Take four of those, please. There. See you soon. All right, over to the gate. Yeah, he is down, down here. been here yet. Okay. I thought I came down here and did the quest on this character, but I guess not. There he is. Hello, or here she I don't is. Care to hear it, adventurer. Nope. No way are you going to be let into the Searing Gorge. Impossible. Not going to happen. How many times do I have to tell you I can't let you in? Do you not speak common? Are you an orc in disguise? An orc? No! If I let you in, then I have to let everybody in. Pretty soon your close friends will want in, then their distant relatives, then their friends, and so on and so forth. The last time that happened? Well, we won't talk about the last time it happened. What's the worst that could happen? Are you mad? Do you know what manner of beast inhabit that place? The worst that can happen is that we'll have to scoop up your remains with a shovel. We've lost some good dwarves to those awful monsters, so the answer is no. If you're bent on getting to the Searing Gorge, you'll have to find another way. Uh, another way? Do tell. I shouldn't even be telling you this, but if you can make it past all the critters and beasties in Badlands, you might be able to make it to Searing Gorge. Okay, we already know about the back way in. What have you got there? A fake, obviously. I've been face to face with Margol, and I know for a fact that her horn is at least eight times larger than the one you've got in your hands, adventurer. You probably got that off of a storm snout in the barrens. No, sir, you can't fool Pebble Biddy. You expect me to believe a story like that? The real horn would have had my broken axe head still lodged into its surface. Listen, take that obvious fake to curate Thorius in Ironforge. If he can validate your claim, you will receive a proof of deed. Bring that proof back to me, and I'll give you the key to the Searing Gorge. Get going! All right. So now we got to go talk to the guy in Ironforge. I knew there was a way to get... We had to go back to Ironforge. I knew that for a fact. So that's why I went ahead and set my hearth here. And I think he's over here in the Hall of Explorers, if I'm not mistaken. Yep, he is. You 
got my attention? What's this? Oh my, I don't believe it. Do you realize what you've got here, person? This is the horn person. of Margol the Rager. <laughs> Margol, the bane of every archaeologist that ever set foot in the Searing Gorge. May I keep it? I can't believe Pebble Bitty doubted the authenticity of the horn. Between you and me, I think she's just jealous. I know she really wanted to kill that beast herself, what with the incident and all. So you need a proof of deed. After the contribution you just made to the museum, it won't be a problem. There we go. You can take that back to Pebble Bitty. All right, so we have the proof of deed for the key to the Searing Gorge. Perfect. The Wildhammer Dwarves might have fast steeds. But can those airy peak griffins stand the heat of the Great Forge? I think not. Calm down there, Girth. Or Grith. Grith? Girth? Grith? I, think, I guess it's Grith. G-R-Y-T-H. Grith. Yeah, we'll go with that. Okay, so we're going to fly back over here to Felsmar once again. And then we're going to turn this into Pebble Bitty. And then we'll fly. We'll make our way back to uh, Searing Gorge. Into Searing Gorge. Which, uh, we have lots of quests to do there. I might just run through, uh, because we, there's a golem here, there's golems down here we can kill, uh, and then we'll make our way down into the, uh, the actual gorge, the cauldron here. You know what, I may as well just clean out my inventory. Well, I don't even have that anymore. Let's just get rid of that. No point in carrying that around with me. Battle elixir. Got a guardian, a guardian, and a battle. There's another one. Need to work on my enchanting some more. Okay. Hey, Pibble Biddy, I am back. Well met. Pibble Biddy. Keep your feet on the... I don't know how someone as weak as you overcame Margol, but a deal is a deal. Here's the key. If anything happens to you after this, it will be your own fault. Thank you. So I never did that in Classic. That's something new. Or in uh, Vanilla. So, cool. Okay, on with questing. Why am I carrying a hearthstone around with me? I have this. Another waste of space. You know, honestly, not that it was necessary to do that quest, but I just thought we'd do it for the hell of it. I mean, it's, 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 it's what it is. Again, like I said, something I've never done in, in vanilla, so let's, let's do it. All right, let's get set up here. That, get a soul stone on. Soul stone up. We're using those elixirs. 
Let's do, um, we'll do spirit. And, oh, those are an hour cooldown. Okay, we'll just do spirit then. All right, that's up, that's up. Let's go ahead and, oh, I got 22 minutes left on that spell stone, so that's, that's all right. Oh, didn't get my, um, did not turn my soul, uh, siphon soul, or drain soul. I always want to say siphon soul. I think I've been playing too much d and I think it's siphon on that one. Something that's similar. Taunt. Let's start this crap again. Oh, there's two golem oil. Let's go, let's go down into the cauldron here. I need these flames. Fire elementals. Oh, he's immune to fire. That makes sense. Oh, these guys have both. That's odd. Why oh, would a rock elemental have both uh, golem oil and heart of flame? Now, flame I could see, probably. I don't know if I can constitute those as golems, though, but I, maybe they are. I don't know. They're, they're, they say elemental, so I don't know. They're a magma elemental. Oh, excuse me. Aunt, thank you. Yeah, he's immune to my wand as well. I wonder if this guy's immune to fire. Nope. Man, Nightfall is proccing like crazy this morning. I feel like last time it didn't hardly it hardly procked at all. Oh, we have all the golem oil. I just love dotting everything and then just let them die <laughs> slowly. Alright, so those taskmasters may have multiple guys with them, so I have to remember that.
snipe this guy. Whoa, that was cool. That was an interesting looking shadow bolt. It was like shadow flame. This does not hurt me. This, I thought this red would may hurt me, but it doesn't. All right, the heart of fire is hard to come by. I, I, the golem oil wasn't that bad. Oh, he's immune. What am I doing? I keep forgetting that. Dark iron scraps. Well, there's a currency. <clears throat> I think the incendiosaurs or dinosaurs we need are underground here. I think. <clears throat> taunt. Yeah, he's hearts of fire. Hearts of flame are going to be hard to, hard to get. We got one so far. That's it. Hey, 20 of these guys. Jeez. Now why don't you attack me? <clears throat> I didn't do anything to you, slave worker. I wasn't going to kill you. I like dwarves. You're my buddies. But apparently, um... You did not like me.
There's some lava. Smithing Turi. Must be above me. Let's work our way through here. See what we can find. This is basically just like Black Rock Mountain. What's this guy doing? He's just running around with a hammer or with a pickaxe. Matic, whatever he's got. I think he has a pickaxe. into me. Okay, so this is another rogue area to uh, level my lock picking. Some lock boxes down here. And I wish you would taunt. Nightfall is rocking this morning. Jeez. But there it goes again. I feel like yesterday it or it didn't didn't proc hardly at all. But today it is. Hmm. Lag. That was weird. A little lag spike there. Ooh, obsidian. Dying archaeologist. Forget about me. Help the others. Release them, human. Even after their bodies given out give out the power of the Sunatra, Suntara, Suntara forces <clears throat> them to complete their tasks. The altar of Suntara is the, is the key. 
Go northwest to the hills above the cave. Twilight's hammer guard a relic. Retrieve it and place it on the altar of Suntara. The dying archaeologist collapses. Okay. Mysterious artifact. Amazing. That guy was almost dead before he ever he ever taunted. I don't understand why he doesn't taunt right away like a bear does, or hunter pets. Oh, the dark iron pillows. I forgot about those. where the pillows are lots of guys in here oh yeah there they are don't worry i'll kill this guy mac taz you you just do what you're doing you just do you Key to freedom. The small brass key looks simple enough. The only thing is that it seems to stand out are some words scratched on the head of it. Dark Iron Outhouse. Do not duplicate. You have no idea what it means or what it will lead to. Okay. Now, how did I pull this guy when he's standing literally right next to him? <laughs> Kill him with sleep deprivation. That's funny. I bought more food and drink, but I may even need more. come from holy cow dude Where the hell did those guys come from <laughs> I remember that when I do this if, if I ever do this quest on a hardcore character holy cow did not expect all those guys to come out of there Uh, let's just drop down here and see if I can get Mactaz to uh, unsummon. There we go. Yeah, I didn't say anything about that. 
That's weird. Someone, our pillars. Someone has stolen our pillars. <laughs> That is kind of funny, though. That was a lot of a lot of guys, <laughs> a lot of pissed off guys. Ooh, a rare. He's not an elite. Oh, not the sleepy guys again. I can't disenchant them. My disenchanting's not high enough. Or my enchanting's not high enough. <laughs> he got one. <laughs> Good job, Mactaz. He actually killed one of the slavers. That he was fighting. Without my help. That's cool. Well, this is not exactly the tactic I wanted to use. Is, you know, working around these slavers. Or not slavers, but the uh, sleepy dwarves. But... Is what it is, I guess. I need to watch for the angry mob of sleepy dwarves. I can't believe he killed that guy. That's awesome. Oh yeah, they're still here. And they're still pissed. Okay, we may have to wait till they calm down before we, uh, or go away. <clears throat> before we make our way in there again. <laughs> we will not let this act of madness go unpunished. They really like their pillows, apparently. Oh, there's the outhouse key. Man, Nightfall, you are rocking this morning. Where are you guys going? Let's go around the other way. We got four pillows is all before the mob showed up, so let's go in this back way. Maybe there'll be some more we can grab. Ah, here they come again. Damn it. Why in the hell are they attacking me? They they completely skipped Mactaz and ran over to me. Why? Why?
All right, this could be harder than I thought, <laughs> getting back in there without killing all those guys. I mean, I guess I could kill him, try him with Rain of Fire, let him grab the aggro. Oh. That's the only way I know, the only thing I can think of. Okay, slavers are done. <clears throat> I want to keep this room clear because if I had to drop back down here, I don't want to be fighting something trying to run away from that mob. And I'll blow through some mana. Is this the only place where the pillows are? Looks like there's some more. Yeah, I guess it is. Hmm. Good thing is we're halfway to 52. That's always a positive. And we're getting lots of mage with cloth, which is which is sweet too, because I need that for uh, tailoring. I don't have mage weave uh, bag yet. I want that. chambermaid where did you come from you weren't there a second ago and you're not even a rare I right, want to try to kill this mob we're gonna we're gonna try it oh we got him well, that wasn't too bad. I think I am going to have to kill this elite, though, unfortunately. I don't know where you came from. The angry mob must have pissed you off. That was a nice crit. Okay. Well, I'm glad I knew I could kill the mob. I didn't realize I could kill them that easily. Oh, hello. Aggro, 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 aggro. There's no way. I'm just whittling her down. Why can't I cast anything? What the? Being smothered by a gigantic pillow. Yeah, this is not going well. We're gonna die. We're gonna die. Uh, where's my pot? Oh, man. Damn it. Mm. Glad this is not a hardcore character, because I'd be pissed right now if I was level 51 and died on a hardcore character right now. Ah, that sucked. She was tough, and she kept silencing me, which really sucked. And if Mac Taz could hold, Mac Taz could hold aggro, that would be really nice. We need one more Taskmaster for the uh, job opportunity quest. I think there's one right here. That's no, a slaver. Alright, let's get everything set back up. I've got that. 
did not use my hellstone. I don't know why I didn't use my hellstone. That was dumb. Elixir of greater firepower recipe. Man, these guys respawn quick. Yeah, note to self, do not try to kill the elite. any character <laughs> unless I'm like level 55 or something and she's like 49 yeah just just laid into me pillow clincher they do not like their pillow stolen I can't even get close now because she's here. Go around the other way, I guess. And again, the grind of higher levels just sucks. One quest finished. I do not have a soul stone up either. Let's go ahead and pop that, get that on, because I want to need that. Yep, she's still here. She was not here when I started this. She must have came with the mob. Grab this one without aggroing her. There we go. Uh oh. Thought she saw me there. I was like, oh. Alright, let's go around the other way. Let's see if I can grab some more from the other side. Can't mount down here either, which sucks.
Now the other thing I could have tried was Death Coil and see if it would have feared her. I don't know if it would have or not since she's an elite. But I didn't try that. Damn it. Pulled her. Shit. Again, I don't need the slavers, but I'm just trying to keep this area clear it's just for this exact reason. If I have to jump down here, it's clear. Wrong button. I meant not to do drain life. I meant to do drain soul. Five more pillows. My goal is to get this done today if we can. Three more. Got it. <laughs> My cast came flying through the air <laughs> toward me. I need soul shards. I didn't realize I was down to two. Okay, pillows are done. Yay. <laughs> Why do you call? Now, where to? Um, we need these incendio sores. I don't know where they are. I don't know if they're through that uh, area where these guys are. I don't know. Pull up on soul shards again. It's quick. All 
All right, let's see if we can get one more thing completed here, maybe, um, before we uh, move on, or before we call it an episode. Because I'm going to have to fly back to Iron Forge, and, or, or hearth back to Iron Forge, and we'll turn these in at the beginning of the next episode. I want to go through... Oh, jeez. Damn it. I want to go through, um, through here and see what's on the other side. At least next time I know when we get here, we'll have to come through here. Get some, Mactaz. Freaking waylaid that guy. We're gonna try to slide through the middle here. I've only seen one heavy war golem so far. Or golem. It shows they're all around me, but I don't I don't see any. Maybe they're up on the surface? Could be. Oh, nice. Okay. Where do I want to go? Go this way. Sorry, guys. I'm just trying to find my way around here. I don't know this area very well. But that way is definitely not uh, the way to go. There's Incendosaur. Again, getting to these guys is a pain. Okay. Oh, uh, he's just resisted it. I thought he was. Yeah. Wow, this guy followed me all the way down here. Jeez. And I need 20 of these guys, too. Lots of grinding. Lots of grinding. Cast a fireball at me. Nice crit. All right, just a couple more minutes here, and we'll have to call it an episode. Oh, excuse me. I would like to get all eight of these guys. Or, I mean, all of these guys today, but... 
We have 16 more to kill, and I'm probably not going to have time for that. I tell you what, let's, um... Hmm. No. Once I hearth, we'll call it an episode there. So let's let's go for a couple more minutes here. I was going to say, I'll just fly back to Thorium Point and turn those quests in, but then I've got to hearth back anyways, because we're going to not be in a rested area. Oh, come on. Stop resisting. And he resist again. That's three in a row. There it is. I wish there was an easier way to get down here. Maybe I have to jump off the um, the cliff and then down into this zone, down down onto one of those uh, large uh, scaffolding areas to drop down in here. Alright, let's kill these last two. We'll be halfway finished with the quest. Then we'll call it an episode. Alright guys, let's call it an episode. I really do appreciate everyone joining me. Thank you, thank you, thank you for clicking on the video and spending a few moments with me. Uh, we will be back on the Human Rogue tomorrow, so tune in for that. A new episode there. Uh, we'll try to knock out some more kobolds and uh, see where that takes us. And the next time on the Warlock, we'll be back in Searing Gorge and continue questing there. But uh, until we meet again, hope everyone has a great day. Take care of yourselves, take care of each other, and we'll see you next time.